Self-care is how you take your power back. Take time to do what makes you so happy. And the only person who could pull me down is myself. And I'm not gonna let myself pull me down anymore. Time you enjoy wasting is not time wasted. This is a couple quotes that resonated with me today um, because I was looking for topics to talk about online because I haven't done a video in a while. But really what I wanted to talk about today was a topic that not a lot of us know how to do and that's self-care. Um, self-care is foreign for us because especially in this world that we live in today, we're taught to constantly be doing something. And when we're not doing something, it feels different. It feels awkward um, because we, we should be going to do something else. We need to go be working out. We need to go to be doing this. We need to be going taking, taking a shower so that you can go somewhere else. I mean, it's like your mind is running a million miles a second. But what I'm trying to get at is that if you do not take time to fill your glass up at the end of the day, how are you expected to fill up other people's every single day? You can't. Um, and that's something that I had to learn because I was trying to do that all the time. And I was always filling up other people's and other individuals' glasses before it came to my own. And it got to the point to where my glass finally was empty. And I had to take some time to step back and really remind myself who I was and what I was trying to accomplish um, by filling other people's glasses up. And if you could take away one topic from this video today, it's that self-care is extremely important. And it is a big benefactor and a huge cause or can be a huge cause of anxiety and self-health, you know? Of course, I'm not a doctor, but from personal experiences, if you do not take time at the end of the day to write down in your journal and to just self-reflect on what happened or just really open up and just try to leave everything outside that has happened in the day, you will become overwhelmed. And it's very easy to get overwhelmed in this society, in this world. And it's so funny because as I wanted to talk about this, I was all in my head and I was like, should I talk about this? This is really kind of a foreign topic for me um, because I'm somebody who likes to stay busy. Self-care is new to me because I come from a family who has the F you attitude, where you're constantly trying to one up and prove yourself. And I'm all for that. I love it. Um, that's just how I was raised. But after a little bit, your, your mind and your body start to wear because you're human. And you have to take time to slow down and remind yourself why you're doing it why you're here in the first place and why you are sharing your story you know so um i'm gonna leave you guys with a quote a quote <laughs> a quote and um it's by gene bowen it says when you recover and discover something that nourishes your soul and brings joy care enough about yourself to make room for it in your life.